Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Quick general love reading for my friends Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Whenever you watch this, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you resonate, let us know, like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for the support. So guys, let's find out together what's coming through for you. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus in the Love Arena. Let's see what we can get for you. Healing Heart. Healing from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationship or addiction. Talking, interested, conversing more, awaited message arrives, text, call, email, hoovering. Bottom of the deck, the phoenix, new phase, rekindle, renew, transformation, growth, changed mind. Let's also pull from the uh, Sacred Traveler Oracle deck, guys. Vast Vistas, expand your horizons. Wise leader, you are a beacon for others. And bottom of the deck, we have Desert Passage, trust, there's a divine plan. Let's see, guys, what the Tarot has to say about these energies. I love the combination between the Wise Leader Oracle card and uh, the Phoenix one. New phase, transformation, growth, inner growth. And we are ready. So your energies, guys. Uh, nine of Wands. Page of Cups. Beautiful Empress Major Arcana. Your person's energies. The Magician. Ten of Swords. World Major Arcana. Meeting Energies. Two of Swords. Death Card. Nine of Pentacles. Focus. Knight of Wands, and yes, bottom of the deck, Seven of Cups, which can be an energy about options, choices, scenarios, decisions to make. I am kind of, I am kind of uh, drawn uh, to the fact that this flow can be about two scenarios. One can be about two single persons that can realize that they are interested in each other uh, quite a lot. Uh, Knight of Wands energy in the focus. And because these two persons are single and available, there can be the opportunity to uh, make an evaluation so that we can embrace a transformation in favor of a new connection. And this is one scenario. This person may have something particularly um, challenging um, to leave behind. The other scenario is a little bit different, uh, meaning that this can be also the completion for a connection that that was not exactly a source of satisfaction because of the nine of one's energy the wounded warrior someone that has gone through a lot of challenges and also because of the ten of swords which is a completion after all with the word even more the Seven of Cups in the second scenario can be about um, multiple factors, multiple reasons, uh, multiple issues within the connection. There can be a choice, a crossroads, in order to transform the situation, death card. We are done in the second scenario and we are moving towards singlehood. Some of you will channel your best Empress uh, version. So, guys, uh, because we have two scenarios, I will... Uh, jump right away into the smaller deck basically and then we are going to talk um, let's start with the seven of cups at this point because i am curious about it 
six of swords, a chance to move forward, leaving behind rough waters. This can speak uh, about the uh, two scenarios, uh, to be honest. Quiet energy. Let's see for you. Nine of Wands, the Wounded Warrior. Defenses are up for protection. Experiences play a role. Ace of Wands. So, if you are single, evaluating a potential new connection, there can be a spark of passion. That's why the Knight of Wands was not about playerish uh, vibration. It's about desire, attraction. And a new spark can come in favor of the wounded warrior. It is fair to say that um, if you were together with um, a special someone, so the second scenario, there can be an opportunity to reignite a spark. We are going to see um, we are going to see how the chance can fit within the reading. Let's see the page of cups guys. The magician. interesting. So, in the uh, scenario where the two of you are single, the magician can offer in favor of, of some of you guys a sweet token of love, sweet act of kindness, the page. And the connection can become more and more interesting. In the scenario that is about a potential completion, uh, the page of cups can be an apology that some of you can receive from allow me to say, the magician person, and then you will have to um, evaluate if the apology is enough. Considering the desert passage, uh, you know, it can be challenging for the apology to be successful. But, let's see, the Empress. What's the point of view of the Empress? She's looking for a healthy growth. Queen of Wands, magnetic, attractive, intuitively guided, Black Cat as a best friend, a healthy self-confidence, guys. This is in favor of you in the two scenarios. So, um, the one that can be about two single persons, you know that passion, desire, attraction uh, play a role within an interaction, but they are not the only forces that should come to play. We need more elements and the Empress also knows that. So you can catch a lot of attention and you will evaluate if this suitor can be the one that you were looking for because the Nine of Pentacles lady is looking for a fair companion. In the scenario that can be about a separation basically, um, you know that passion was a factor, but um, there were also other aspects that uh, may have brought the two of you to realize that the connection was not working as you may have desired it to work. Let's see for this person, let's see, the magician. This is one of those readings with multiple uh, scenarios always fun for me to uh, challenge uh, my English skills. So bear with me. The Magician. This one. The Lovers, my goodness. When it comes to the opportunity to uh, embrace a new connection, there is a, a, powerful, um, a powerful recognition on a soul level, the Lovers. There is a pull towards each other and it is also a crossroads, heart over head decision. That's why this person can even take the lead. You may like um, you may like this coming from this person. And in the scenario again about the potential separation, there is a choice. There is a choice also because of the two of swords. This person knows that um, they may they may still try to um, to save the day. Ten of Swords, Star Energy. In the first scenario, this person basically um, has recognized or can recognize a wish granted in 
a connection with some of you guys. And if they have left behind uh, disappointments, Ten of Swords, um, a previous completion going with the ward, uh, they can truly find healing, healing from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationship um, within a connection with some of you. The, the scenario about the potential separation is kind of kind of interesting because the star is a contrast considering the uh, ten of swords i just want to say that maybe this person is still hoping to avoid the ten of swords let's see the word because the word is another energy about completion and in that scenario is extremely meaningful also because we have the death card in the meeting queen of pentacles nurturing and caring when it comes to the new connection, this is a mindset coming from this person that can resonate quite a lot with the Empress. Uh, taking care of um, a connection, for example. The Queen of Pentacles is a beautiful human being and she can be a source of advices, words of encouragement and support. When it comes to the potential separation, maybe this was what was lacking coming from um, this person. Let's see the meeting, guys. Two of Swords, Crossroads, Closed Off Approach, Four of Wands. The new connection has a lot of potential because the two of you can focus your evaluation in order to understand if you can go the distance together. 11-11 card, Soulful Partnership, uh, Solid Foundations, a chance to celebrate. Uh, it is also possible that in the scenario that can be about a separation, the the two of you were married or were trying to manifest a four of ones type of energy but it was not possible the death card the empress this can be the opportunity for the empress single and shining bright to embrace a revolution in order to uh, pursue the four of ones as an opportunity for commitment and this should be an encouragement in the second scenario, basically, the Empress, so some of you guys, uh, can be the one with the final call about the connection. And the Death card in that, uh, in that case can be truly a, a transformation. And so a situation as it was uh, can be completely different moving forward. Let's see the Nine of Pentacles, King of Swords, uh, Truth and Clarity precise energy of uh, communication the king can pay a lot of attention to all the factors that are around him and he can make the best possible decision about what comes next this is incredibly important considering the seven of cups because in the scenario that is about the opportunity to embrace a new connection there can be a conversation between the two of you that can allow uh, to achieve clarity and so you can figure out that is not just a matter of passion and desire but there can be the opportunity to build on solid foundations and in the second scenario the one about a potential separation this is the final conversation uh, talking basically and bottom of the smaller deck we get the death card one more time this is a big transition guys um, towards a partnership for those of you single and uh, with the chance to recognize a potential fair companion and also a transition for those uh, of you that can uh, leave behind a connection that maybe was not um, was not fulfilling as you may have desired it to be so guys some more oracle cards for guidance considering these energies we have weight it can be a time factor uh, it can even be a decision to not rush the process when it comes to the new connection. It can be a fair decision, if you ask me. No need to rush the process, basically. Um, when it comes to the potential separation, this person is waiting for your decision. And we have let go that, guys, uh, speaks uh, about the second scenario, not the first one. Don't stop can be about the movement forward, basically. In the two scenario, uh, in the two scenarios, the first one can be extremely successful, 
we have abundance I will pull it because it is meaningful and uh, the second one uh, can be can be a completion extremely important but also the chance to allow a new phase to begin we have trust also involved in the reading a uh, key element for me um, maybe trust was challenged in the situation that is facing a completion and also trust can be a major major factor in favor of the new partnership the one that can be embraced guys i hope that i made myself clear this was one of those uh complex readings uh, i hope it was helpful let us know if you resonate comment like share subscribe to the channel until next time i wish you all the best take very good care of you and i will talk to you soon bye